<laughs> fuel, heat, and oxygen. Yes. Everybody hear that? Everybody, everybody see it? Uh, it wasn't an intense, hot burning, 2000 degree uh, sudden occurrence event. It was just we took some packing paper, some brown paper, some tissue paper and threw it in there. It burned for, you guys saw it, uh, 30 seconds, 40 seconds. Uh, but the temperature in there was enough where it heated up the inside surface a lot faster than it could heat up the outside surface. So it causes it to crack. Uh, that's why clay liner in a chimney, uh, it's not intended for combustion. It's just intended to vent the flue gases from the outside. So if someone has a chimney flue fire, it's likely that the chimney tiles are gonna crack. And you'll see as this crack closes up, uh, sometimes these tiles actually explode when we're out here doing the demonstration, but this is actually good that it's gonna close back up and you'll look at it and you'll be able to say, okay, if that flue tile's dirty a little bit on the inside, we might not even see the crack. Uh, it, close up and just disappear. Clay liners are not intended to contain combustion. Uh, so we want to keep fire in the firebox and never let it happen in the chimney flow. Uh, so maintenance is real important. Uh, if a, a clay liner opens up like that, where that crack is during a fire, and there's chimney right outside of it, and there's improper framing clearances. Uh, we just talked about it, one inch on exterior chimneys, two inches on interior chimneys during a fire, you could have heat pass through that crack uh, and uh, heat transfer to adjacent combustibles. During normal operation, it might not be as much of an issue, but if you have 2,000 degrees in there from a chimney flue fire, you could actually catch the house on fire during the chimney flue fire. Hire a qualified CSIA certified chimney sweep for your annual chimney inspection because it's where you live.